Thanks for coming back to SourceFed. This is the last story of the day. I'm Joe Beretta. I'm Lee Newton. And this is 20 Minutes or Less. Draw! Oh! Oh, she got me! Big interesting news in the video game slash internet slash record breaking realm. In an attempt to raise funds for an old school type adventure game, Tim Schafer and his Double Fine production company have shattered the record for money made in a 24 hour period on the Kickstarter website. Tim Schafer is best known for being involved in old school classics such as Grim Fandango, Psychonaut, The Secret of Monkey Island, and The Day of the Tentacle. Tim Schafer resorted to Kickstarter because the video game publishers laughed in his face whenever he brought up the idea of another adventure game. Instead of listening to the suits, he went directly to the fans and made a video that asked them to help him make the project. We are asking for this much to make the game and this much to film it. Here's my promise to you. Either the game will be great or it'll be a spectacular failure caught on camera for everyone to see. Either way, you win. Schaefer opened the Kickstarter account yesterday and hopes to raise $300,000 for video game production and $100,000 for a documentary on the whole game making process. They shattered the mark in a mere eight hours, surpassing $400,000 like that. At the moment you're watching this video, they've probably surpassed $1 million and probably have somewhere in the realm of 26,000 backers. It's hard to pinpoint it right now because they're raising money at a clip of $1,000 per minute. It's incredible. And what will they do with all that extra money, you ask? Well, so far, they've been really great about keeping backers updated and they've already released a statement explaining that all money raised will go to make the game and the documentary better. Additional money means that it can appear on more platforms, be translated into more languages, have more music and voice, and an original soundtrack for the documentary. I love this. The final product is a long way down the line, but if this is successful, it's going to open up the doors for future fan interaction. If other companies follow suit, the future of video game production could be guided by the voice of the players, and that's awesome. And it seems like Schaefer is actually caring about the voice of the people. Schaefer plans on releasing video diaries and keeping backers up to date during the whole process and continues to let their opinions mold the game along the way. If you're thinking of making a donation, they've also created a fun list of perks for those that donate a certain amount. For instance, $15 will get you a copy of the game, and $50,000 will put you in the game as a character. Go to DoubleFine.com for a full list of the perks. So what do you guys think? Could this be the future of video game production, maybe even entertainment in general, or is this a one-time pony show? Let us know in the comments down below. Like, subscribe, click the annotations for more stories of the day. And don't forget to check us out tomorrow when we do our comment commentary, one of our favorite shows of the mm -hmm. week. It's true. Mm -hmm. I'm Lee Newton. I'm Joe Beretta. A squirrel! No, Joe!